A Grass Valley viewer says she's out $20,000 after the water company's canal flooded her property. And when they refused to cover the bill, she called Curtis. Yeah, the company admits the water did come from its canal. In fact, it's now spending millions to replace parts of it. So why won't they cover her damage? Check out the flooding on Lisa Osterholm's property in January of 2018. The Nevada Irrigation District's canal overflowed, buckling her driveway. She says it cost 20 grand to fix the damage. It was running like a small river, just it was unbelievable. She says she followed the district's instructions, mailing in this form within a year as required, but without an exact dollar amount because the work wasn't finished. It wasn't until this May she finally submitted those receipts, but the district denied the claim, saying it was not presented within the time allowed by law. She says the district now says it never received her first claim form within a year and she can't prove she mailed it in. It's a bit mind-boggling, to say the least. I think they should do the right thing and the appropriate thing, which is cover the damage. Well, the district won't talk with us about this case, concerned it'll end up in court, but we have a couple takeaways here. If an agency damages your property, you gotta get it fixed right away or at least get those bids right away to fix it because wasting time often makes the repair more expensive and that could cause problems. She submitted receipts 28 months later, which could make paying this claim messy. Also, you wanna make your claim in person within the time frame allowed, asking for a receipt or certified mail so you have a timestamp as proof you filed the claim in time.